This is another one of my additions. This is another edition. This is another edition of my Poor Man's Guide to Living series. And this one is your Poor Man's, Angelo's Poor Man's Guide to your morning routine, including making breakfast and shaving. So first of all, somebody gave me one of these stone wave microwave cooker. And here's what it looks like. It's very simple, no assembly required. So I tried it out to see if it works. And what, there, what it said on here, that was interesting, is you can make, it says poached eggs. Um, I don't like all these terms for eggs, uh, by the way, I disagree with them. Uh, it's not a personal thing, it's an ethical objection I have. Um, but the uh, I, sunny side up and over easy, all this crap, I don't even know what any of it means. Um, but the guide that this thing comes with says uh, you can put two eggs in here you can scramble them, whatever. I just drop them in because I'm lazy. And set the microwave on high for one and a half minutes. And then cook another, try it another 15 seconds, 15 second intervals if it's not fully cooked. It wasn't fully cooked after a minute and a half because this piece of crap microwave, you can't change the power on it. Um, so I ended up doing it two minutes total, I think, when I did the 15 second intervals and they actually came out good. You don't have to put olive oil in here and uh, you can just clean it right out. So it's so much faster than cooking it on a skillet, which I would do over here, cleaning up the thing. Every six months or so, I gotta replace my skillets. Um, using up olive oil, none of that. So this is so much easier. So I appreciate that, that this thing actually works and let's see if uh, that thing breaks in a week or not. Okay, you pussy asses. Since I know you probably all would actually like to see me demonstrate this, I'll do it very simple. Does work. Okay, so that's it for putting the eggs in. And then I'm going to microwave it for two minutes and 10 seconds. And that's probably uh, gonna make it work on this crappy microwave. And uh, you don't need olive oil, you don't need anything. And then I'll put all my spices and shit on it. Dollar store bread. Very nice. This is the cheapest uh, vegetable oil spread I could get. Because it was slightly undercooked at two minutes yesterday total. Well, actually, why don't I do it two minutes if it needs any more? It wasn't undercooked really, there was a small part that wasn't done. Part of my poor man's morning routine. I'll make tea or coffee, and this I got at H Mart, this Korean grocery store. It was pretty cheap. It was like maybe four or five dollars, like 50 bags of British uh, black tea, like breakfast tea or something. So anything that's like 50 bags, hey, that's better than getting like 14 or 16 bags for the same price. Okay, I just missed it. It scared me. One of the eggs like burst inside this thing. You can see. Oh <laughs> shit! On here. Oh fuck. Man, I didn't want to have to clean this up. Okay. Sometimes the poor man's videos are even educational for me. Is it too hot? Okay, that's pretty good. So, shit, man. This microwave's kept... It's been able to stay pretty clean for a while. Come out. By the way, this is nice for like three dollars, the cheapest vegetable oil spread. Uh, maybe it has stuff you're not supposed to have too much of, but uh, you're poor man, your life only has so much worth. Here we go, can we see this? Yes. Look at that, slides right out. Told you. Easy. Okay, poor man's guide to shaving is going to take me less than two minutes. First of all, I've uh, used other razors. I strongly prefer the Gillette Mach 3 to all others. Um, it's just, it just seems sharper. It seems to get the best, you know, smoothest shaved I like to have. Um, really close shaves and I have kind of coarse facial hair. I've I tried once switching to 
a Chic Quattro or whatever it was. It was crap. Oh my goodness, cut the fuck out of my face. So anyways, okay, I use these, but the cartridges can be expensive. They are expensive. It's like $18 a pack or something for like a regular pack. So what I learned is to help preserve the razor from corrosion is, well, first of all, what causes the corrosion is the water that stays on there and it's like the minerals get on there and stuff and it rusts and everything. Damn it, I'm trying to get this in focus. There. Um, so when you're done shaving, simply get a towel and go like this. And not too hard, just dry it off. Don't pull it this way so you're shaving the towel and you're messing up the blades. Just go like this, dry it off. That's all, just dry it. So boom, there's your fucking poor man's guide to uh, shaving and making breakfast. Again, saving time is an important part of being a poor man because, uh, you know, nobody's going to like you unless you're working a lot for a little money because, uh, you know, rich people, they don't, uh, they, what, bleh. I don't know what I was going to say. Women, that'll work too with your razors. Um, wipe that on a towel and, uh, I don't know, just everybody leave me alone.